So apparently, like, she screwed around with a couple different mayors and all kinds of stuff. And she's pictured with Swalwell. That was his his lady friend. And I, and this guy sits on the intelligence committee. Married. Well, what did it happen at the time he was married? Well, it, no, it's 2016. Is he a man too? He got married in 2016. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up, hold up. Well, this, but this is 2013. Oh. So there you go. Right. But still. I mean, come on. He's he's one of those guys who is a failure to launch. He never grows up. And so she, the first time she met him, I think was like 2013. She met him through some kind of student association. But in January 2015, that's when he was seated on the uh, House Permanent Select Committee for Intelligence. So he was on the Intel Committee. He was like one of the lead Democrats. He, uh, so when he was with her, apparently is when he was climbing the ranks and that was his, yeah, so that that was his, that was his lady. She also acted as a bundler for him, according to this Axios piece. Brought in all these donors. So he literally was getting money from the communist Chinese to run his campaign. She was getting all this money for him. This is crazy. Crazy. He had the audacity to sit here and tell everyone else that they were Russian spies. He even insinuated somehow because, you know, that's, con- you know, that's like common, I guess, a, a, to say in a discussion when someone that you don't like has an opinion that you don't share and you're not smart enough to refute it or articulate any kind of like intelligent or at least written on social media legible or literate rebuttal. You just insinuate or just straight out call them a Russian conspirator or something like that. But this guy was screwing around with the communist Chinese. And I mean, quite literally. Sits on the intel committee. This is like Dianne Feinstein having a communist Chinese driver spy for 30 years and not knowing. How dumb are these people? How do you not know this stuff? How do you not know this? I'm sketchy if people try to be nice to me too much. You know what? I suspect they did know it. That's what I suspect. But you think that he was just thinking... Because there was money there. He was thinking with a little Eric? I don't know. That could be, but I'm thinking more along the lines of money and, and influence. Well, he yeah, he liked that commie money. Yeah, she was raising a lot of money for him. Yeah, he called for semi-auto firearms to be confiscated, said he'd, luke, he'd nuke law-abiding gun owners, and he was dumb enough to be duped by a honey trap communist spy girlfriend as he sits on the intel committee. This guy... The guy who looks like he permanently has braces and everything that goes with it. That guy. The failure to launch Eric Swalwell. 